lesson three, uh, chapter one, uh, grade one. Uh, this is uh, the uh, third lesson in grade one, and uh, it is for a period of one uh, session, one hour. Uh, the objectives of the lesson is to learn where the computer is used and uh, learning why a computer is used. So as you will see uh, that this uh, page is really colorful and uh, they will like it since there is too much graphic inside it. And while enjoying the pictures, uh, students will learn uh, where a computer is used and why it is used. And this is the most important since maybe kids uh, will uh, will tell you okay i will use the computer just uh, to surf the internet or just to uh, watch uh, uh, watch a movie or something like that so uh, as you can see we'll start the uh, lesson by uh, a few pictures like uh, eight pictures and uh, we'll explain them that the computer is used at the airport in a garden at school at the hospital and here uh, try to make a discussion with your students in order not to list them just where to use the computer. Just uh, 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 conduct with them a discussion. Tell them, uh, 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 let's say, in the airport, or maybe it's 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 not uh, uh, practical as an example. Maybe in the garden or at school. Uh, 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 why I use it? or at the hospital why I use it try to um, to ask the students even if they uh, did not travel or I don't know uh, went to a pharmacy or to or to the hospital try to imagine why they uh, use uh, a computer uh, at a bank in a car uh, in a restaurant <coughs> uh, maybe in a factory and so on so it's really important to understand why the computer is used in such places. And then after this discussion, you will uh, move to the second page uh, by asking them uh, what I can do in a computer. And if you see here, we link uh, the drawing to uh, simplify the task for students in order to uh, to write uh, like here I can draw I can listen to music I can read I can uh, watch a movie uh, I can play a game I can type and so on so it's really uh, useful to make uh, this lesson uh, and after that uh, if you are teaching online on distance learning you can send the interactive PDF to students in order to make them uh, practice this uh, uh, sheet at home and then uh, to send it back uh, uh, to you in order to see if they uh, acquire this lesson uh, or not and if you have an additional time during this period you can ask them to practice a little bit the software J Compre, where there is a lot of uh, educational activities they can uh, practice.